chain link trend reversal and biggest breakout welcome back guys it's crypto rocco from rockstar trading channel in today's video guys i'll be sharing with you my thoughts of chain link potentially changing his trend and hitting new highs again so guys the first thing i'd like to say is guys chain link has already had a big move and when we have a big move like that sometimes it takes a bit of time to consolidate so one thing I'd like to add is if you remember my previous video or if you've been following me you know I've been doing a lot of work on on understanding how long uh, uh, the time aspect we always talk about price we don't really talk as much about time so looking at timing cycles guys usually it takes a little bit longer before we can see a breakout so the minimum one we've seen is uh, around about seven weeks uh, is taken uh, for it to break out so we could potentially consolidate uh, another few weeks maybe all of November then we could have a breakout so that would be the first point I want to make and the reason I'm making this video is or well, another reason I'm making this video is someone asked me about trend changes so in my, I made a video on Chainlink talking about a biggest breakout so I recommend you go watch that video if you want to stay up to date with what I'm doing if you're trading Chainlink you might want to check out uh, my Chainlink videos I've been making them almost every other week or at least one a month so you can check them out to see what my thought process and learn from it a lot of people that have taken my trading course they they go watch those videos and try to learn exactly what I'm doing and and try to replicate it and that's how you get better so I'd recommend that but let's actually look at the trend change that I'm talking about so on the weekly we are in a uptrend and and that's as simple as that on the daily as well I would argue that we're still in an uptrend so if we break below this red zone it would be bearish so that is the bearish scenario on the hourly or four hourly time frame I've actually taken a trade um, at the, uh, using our pullback strategy that I teach again you can go check it out guys two months left and um, there's still one slot left I think actually that sold out but I might release a couple of slots again later in the week I've got a full trading course and um, you can you can it's also got signals where the main part of it is a trading course and you can learn from the signals and and make money but also use this to see how I get you signals so you can create your own signals so do check that out guys but yeah that's uh, I've taken a trade here I've, I think I'm gonna sell some now for a couple of percent profit and then I'll see how what what happens and um, I wanted to get above this 200 moving average on the 15 minute time frame and I want to see a push through but do I think it will break out into new highs now I do not think that because like I said I'd like to see a bit more consolidation but if we keep ranging and break out I'm going to be buying the breakout because one good thing is when we see pumps like that you can see a breakdown and it breaks below when it doesn't break below there's something going on that we don't do, that we do not know about I'm not saying blindly buy here because I say shared a signal here if you've subscribed to my channel and turn on the notification button you would have known about this falling wedge pattern I've shared the signals and exact entry in the group and I've shared the videos on free for YouTube as well if it happens again I'll keep you guys up to date but I'd like to see a bit more consolidation one thing that I would not like to see is so one thing I did get wrong so this was the one that I got right this is what I got wrong because I thought uh, this wouldn't have another push and it did have a push I didn't take a trade so I didn't make any money but I could have made money uh, if I did uh, take this trade but I did say that I wouldn't be buying a breakout and we saw the reason why I wasn't interested in that and um, so what I wanted to share with you now is on on this chart we had a big push up we can see it did a similar sort of pattern it had a big move up it, uh, then it fell and it tried again and it made a slight high high and then it broke below support that is a bearish scenario we do not want to see if we see that guys if you own chain link you might want to take some profits um because we do not want to see that but at the moment it is currently in range uh, we're going to see what happens if it does consolidate for a bit and we see a maybe an ascending triangle where it does something like this and then it breaks out or maybe a cup and handle or a pattern like that guys what we'll be looking at uh, to take a potential trade so um I'll keep you guys up to date. So hopefully that clarifies the trend reversal what people what I was trying to explain in my previous video and um 
and also it clarifies what I'll be looking at to trade. I'll keep you guys up to date because markets change. If there's a different move that come up, then I'll have to change my analysis again. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button to stay up to date. And if you're interested in a full crypto currency f uh, educational trading course explaining how I actually do this market with a weekly video, you can join now guys if you join now you get the full course and it's available until december so thank you very much for watching this video i hope you guys have enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it guys make sure you smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button to end this video guys my question to you guys is what is your thoughts on Chainlink? Do you think it will break out again or do you think it will break down? Long term, I do think Chainlink could uh, be very good. Even if it pulls back, uh, Chainlink can pull off something like this again because it's new and I like the technology. But I'm more of a trader, so I'll be looking at trading it. But I'd love to hear your thoughts. So comment below your price prediction or your thoughts on Chainlink and let's have a discussion. So thank you very much. Smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much.